Before we get started, yes, well, no. The team are not getting all specialismas. They have a choice of any Bianchi. Well, they don't have a choice of them. They have to either buy any of them. So whatever their price point is, they can go for. So that's that, because I know a lots of confusion there in that last vlog with me unveil unveiling, unboxing Gus's XR4. So there'll be more of those as we go along. Yes, we were at the Melbourne Supercrit, Shimano Supercrit in Melbourne. <laughs> Consistently up the front. That was really cool. We weren't there and Nero was there, which is like the next phase, I suppose, to this whole thing. So you'll see more of that. We're, we're going to try and have a close knit sort of VRS team, some guys racing down south of the border. Now, oh, thirdly, I must also add, sorry to Instagram. There is just no excuse. Moving on. So here's the thing, we've got lots of different stuff coming in this week, either for the team, for us, things like, well that table, really not interesting, this is how to draw away viewers. This little bit here, not the Zakatas, this little bit here can come across very much as a sales pitch. It's definitely a more comfortable fit. But I will say this, the kind of features that I'm going to talk about in the Lycra is something that it is worth knowing, like it is worth for you guys spotting between any brand. Without further ado, I present you the chairman. Put my bum just there. I really wanted to produce a short that was a core range. It's just something that you can pull out, wear all the time, back at 100%. So yeah, yeah, it's hard wearing, it's comfortable, blah, blah, blah. But how is that any different? To any other cycling brand that claims to have an all-wearing bib short. Well, here's a couple of things, right? First one, it's tested by us. It's tested by the team. It's tested by the guys you know. The other thing, this hasn't just been tested, the little Instagram gravel photos. We've tried everything at it. We've tried Melbourne to Warrnambool. So just one of you guys. All the way down to a hell of a lot of time on a time trial bike. And as you guys probably know, time trial bike positions are, let's just say, everything moves into a slightly more aggressive location. So really the benefit of the pre-dyed stuff is that faded, avoiding that faded look and the durability of it. Anytime you print on Lycra, it has to be sublimated, which means really what you're doing is you're getting white Lycra you're printing on it, and then you're putting, you're trying to color match to the other color of your shorts. With pre-dyed Lycra, it's dyed throughout. So the color maintains the same across the inside and the outside. In reality, what does that mean? Well, you do the Lycra stretch test and you won't find any kind of color alteration. Now, the challenge of pre-dyed Lycra, wow, this is serious Lycra chat, but just bear with me. The, the challenge of pre-dyed Lycra is so not all pre-dyed lycra is created equal. For example, the chairman stuff, what we've ended up doing is lengthening the leg length by two centimeters. This is a longer leg length. They're not for everyone. I'm not gonna lie to you. Some people will be put off by how long the leg is. I've always wanted on bib shorts, full long coverage, and these offer it. This is so humid. It is a less racy feel, yes, but it is something, I mean, oh, the guys are all racing in it next year, so that's, what the case is, but it is definitely a more comfortable fit. So stop. I think it's the car. Round and round the wheels on the back. What's in the way? Some cyclists in the way. Are you Toby? Well. So tonight's a little bit of an emotional one. As we, as you know, this fellow's moving on next year to bigger and brighter things. This is tonight's our last race with him. Tonight's race is the trophy race at Heffron. It's a scratch race, it's over an hour. It's gonna be pretty serious. But yeah, there's a, there's a slight sense of tinge of sadness. Now the name of today's vlog is gonna be Farewell Goldilocks. What were your Goldilocks highlights? Here's my roommate for most races, and that's a good banter. Oh, do you have a song? Do you guys have a song? Yeah, we do. Girl is a real crowd pleaser. <laughs> the, great, the great thing about Toby is he doesn't want to ever talk on camera. 
So we can pretty much say whatever we want about him. Free ride ritual for Toby Do Orchard. Uh, cologne. Yep, oh, that's always. right. Always yeah. runs cologne. He has many deodorants. He brings his Embrocation. Very big on Embro. Very big on Embro. It's been fun, Toby. Let's go win this race, hey? Burgers and beers. Now there's a joint called Bear Grill that's been on the hit list for a long time. It's now a table and luckily it's BYO. Oh well, it's bringing me down. <laughs> Reasonably okay for how fast we hit the deck. King Valley stage, yeah. Scott Nero. Oh, that was such a ridiculously hard race. I, there was Ladies and gentlemen, at the one point female, in the break, I thought, oh, I don't think this is going to stick. So I tried to like go back to the bunch, and then I was like, no, that's stupid. Why would I do that? I probably should stay on the break, break. and then. A couple laps to go, I was like, oh damn, we're, all right, we're going to sprint this out, okay. That's the hardest man in the bunch, a mountain biker and myself, okay, let's see how this pans out. <laughs> yes, I'm on the block! Life is good, I'm so happy. I have my name on my bike because Bunny. <laughs> Winner. <laughs> <It's my name. laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> when we were having a, an in joke of Tumi Win on uh, Great South Coast and halfway through the race. And Toby said, get me up the front. I said, tell me you win. He just goes, just get me up the front. <laughs> Toby, what's your highlight? Probably like the 12 pisses at Warney. <laughs> and like just coming back to the car just for chats and just <laughs> coming back and I'm like, do you want a water bottle? He's like, nah, I just wanted to see how you were going. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we're gonna sign off. This is not all. This is not what happens when someone, everyone leaves. <laughs> you, know, you don't get a whole vlog dedicated to you. Any parting words? Uh, uh, don't run over that dude. That's probably. The... I think you've, you've got to finish with your catchphrase, Toby. I got nothing to say. <laughs> That's it. We're done. Trophy race done. Uh, congrats to Tristan Ward for winning, and we will see you.